I fully intended on finishing this treat yesterday, but what had happened was I actually had my nose piercing ripped out by my son's hair accidentally. So I was just out. I was out, couldn't do anything else. I think it's probably closed up by now. Of course, it's like a Sunday, so piercing places are closed. So my nose hole is also probably closed. A hot mess, but I'm gonna get back into it um, and finish putting the ornaments up on the tree and then do the other decorating around the house. There are one or two more things that I wanna buy, so I also might try and quickly um, hop out while the kid is asleep to go and buy those, but otherwise, I can see my vision. I can see it coming together. back from the store I went to House of Leather. I needed to buy another um, star and I got this from House of Leather. So I picked that up and they also had bottle brush trees, which I was actually looking for when I went shopping yesterday and didn't see any. So I'm excited about these. I think I'm gonna put them in front of the TV. Although to be real, we're gonna have to move them every day because the kid likes to play with things in front of the TV. Um, yeah, that's really, oh, and then I got these baskets that I am hoping can I can put the trees inside, um, but the kid is sleeping and if I put him down, he's gonna wake up. So I'm just gonna try and do what I gotta do while wearing him. It's, I'm so hot, it's like, <sighs> all right. So I wanted to quickly show you guys how the house looks in the evening, because we all know that Christmas decor looks best in the nighttime once all the lights are on. So ignore what I look like and focus on what you are about to see and experience. All right, so first we have this garland that I hung over the door. We are getting a new shoe cabinet soon. Cannot wait to have all those hidden. But for right now, this is what it looks like. I just strung some lights around the garland. These lights are from House of Leather. The garland was from Carrefour. I did hang like two ornaments on them just to, I don't know, be a little something extra. So that is at the front door. Then if you turn around, in the living room, you have the two wreaths. So these wreaths are from Carrefour. I had this one last year. And then that one is the one that you saw me buy earlier. So these two wreaths kind of frame the bookcases. I still feel like this part is kind of empty, but I did add this red blanket here. This is an airline blanket, so no idea what airline it's from. Facing the TV, we have just a few things. Surprisingly, my son hasn't knocked them down yet. So I put a couple of these bottle brush trees that I found at House of Leather. 
two on one side and then another one on this side. And then this little ornament sleigh that I bought at car four. So that is what frames the TV. Now, as you walk towards the main area, first of all, this is just kind of chilling by itself because <laughs> there's really like nothing here yet. But we have our double trees. I love how they look. Um, I decided to just keep the blankets. I was going to get baskets for them, but um, decided to just keep the blankets because it's not that serious. And then as you approach the hallway, let me turn on the lights. We have our little, I don't know, wooden tree here. I like that it's battery operated, so um, there are no like wires hanging down. But this is a much more like minimal vibe um, than kind of the rest of the decor. And this one was from Game. That was the only thing that I bought from Game, aside from this second tree. And in the dining room, we have... These two trees, these were from Carrefour. This is from our wedding, this dish is from our wedding, but I just put a bunch of ornaments on there, um, which is fun when my son's eating, we'll just like give him one to play with and then he'll just throw them all on the floor. It keeps him occupied and that works. So I do wanna get a runner, so that will happen eventually. I need to do something with the other garland, but so far that is our holiday decor. I think that it looks nice and festive and definitely puts us in the holiday spirit. So let me turn off all the lights. Oops, that's not on. So that you can enjoy it in all of its glory. Yay! Like this is just my favorite view ever. Well, not ever, actually nowhere near ever, but my favorite view for right now. <laughs> So there it is, my holiday decor. There are a couple more things that I want to do. I do want to get a woven table runner for the dining table, um, and I have to figure out. I have to figure out what to do with this. Maybe I'll put it in the bedroom. Maybe I'll return it. Um, but otherwise, I mean, or maybe it could just like live right here. But um, otherwise, I'm I'm pretty satisfied. I'm pretty satisfied with how it came out. Oh, I haven't used. The, there's another garland that I had, and so I have a DIY project that I have planned for that. So you'll have to stay tuned for that video coming later. But otherwise, I now feel like the house is in the holiday spirit. I just need a cranberry or cinnamon candle, and then I'm all set. All right, guys, see you in the next video.